Hello guys. Hello guys. <coughs> Hello guys. Well, come back. All right. Another tutorial how to restore back your Poco X3 Pro to stock original size of the user data after you install the Windows 11 or Windows 10 on your user data partition you see my internal storage left only 39 GB out of 2 3 2 GB of internal storage for user data so to restore back the user data size to the original partition you need to flash the GPT both zero file to the partition zero. The file you can get it from the fast food drum of your device for Poco X3 by you my latest firmware that I use are the 14.03 on this device on the image you can get the GPT of 0 you flash this file right before that we check the now we are rebooting to recovery we check the windows partition on the system there are two partition for windows one is uh, EFS and one is for windows Let's see the windows Hundred and add six GB. So disable. Go to mount. Disable MTP. What happened to my? Disable MTP. All right. You can check. Make sure you use the modified recovery. By you. So, going to mount the partition. Button. Space. Backslash. Developer. Backslash. Block. Backslash. SDA. We're going to mount the STA block A LUN0 or block 0 and enter P. You see our windows got two because when you install Windows, your user data are uh, use part of it for Windows two partition create for windows and we're going to remove these two partition restore back to the original size 255 GB come on what happened to my Wi-Fi
still in recovery. Remove this two partition. Okay. To flash the file, you need to boot the pawn to boot loader. Fast boot ROM value. For the fast boot ROM, you can get it from the web. Let's search for firmware also. Can hear from from here. You can download the if you are you. Using the Indian one, get the Indian. Or if you are using the global, get the global fast put. Get the fast put. Five mirror. Choose the one that are faster on your browser. Depend on your internet speed. Okay, when you get the passport from this is the folder for the passport from inside here we need just GPT of zero copy it to the desktop alright open your command a normal command this is the administration command. When you see system 32, this one the normal one when you see your username. Okay. This is the file. We're going to press the partition 0. Pass. Good. Access. Check. It's connected. You can check on your device manager. This is the if you get a exclamation mark, the device not detected. Update the driver, pause the computer. Should be this one. Also the same. Doesn't matter. Fast. Okay, device are connected in a passport. So we're going to flash fast flash partition column and the number zero space just pull your file the gpt bob zero to the command prompt or right click copy as pub also can pull and drop and enter oh sorry enter now it's pressing the partition 0 to the oh sorry it's pressing the GPT buff 0 this is the script to resize the partition 0 to back to the original size When we resize the user data, your data must be wiped and erased and reformat back. Or you can use the password, erase. Minus 
example, rest the the other user data into cache. The best is format uh, ARS user data output ARS user data, or you can boot to recovery. Use the recovery to wipe the user data. Sometimes when you use this command, the data are not precise to its original state. The size. Okay, plus put put your Android uh, reset because we resize the Android user data normally when you erase over here the size will not get back to its original if not we have to use the recovery to wipe or format the uh, user data also when you install window your user data also will be erased same thing also when you get back to the original state when you want your original size of your user data maybe you want to sell your phone for whatever reason, I just skip. We want to see the size of the resize. Oh, file transfer. See, still as before that mean we need to put to recovery that's why the recovery are the best the stop hold the volume plus the best way to format the user data sometimes the Using the command, it will not erase fully the user data. So, go to what format data and type yes. Come on, why my camera here and enter? See, alright, the user data already wiped able to system that's why better use the recovery to format the user data the device will be reset for the second time and this we see whether it back to the top size of this device the partition of the user data for the 256 GB device roughly around 232 GB of user data Two to six 
already back to the original size okay if you want to check whether the windows and uh, uh, the two windows partition still there you can boot back to recovery restart and hold the volume plus because I haven't enabled the uh, edit one boot on this uh, custom ROM the line SOS on other custom ROM the default one uh, got the uh, add one recover add one boot so go to mount disable MTP open your command prompt edit B shell parted space backslash revolver backslash block backslash SDA and P print see your user data already back to this original size we only edit the uh, block A or block 0 you can check on the other block quit button oh SDB. This is the second uh, part, second block of the partition. What inside it is the extension of the bootloader XPL. So. C what on the third one XPL also this one is a backup on the D S D D B on the D not so much, this one is uh, also the backup SDE on the E, wow, this one If you accidentally erase everything on your phone, you have to restore back all this thing. Some of the partition are actually not visible to user. That's mean it. For safety, they disable the flash tool to flash some of the partition, especially the EFS partition. That one contain your ID, your IME. So don't mess up this partition. Only edit the A block.
aqui você está usa when you flash a custom ROM normally the flash the system super because this uh, dynamic partition on this Poco X3 Pro are using uh, dynamic partition all the vendor the in the system image the the Google all inside this super partition to flash it uh, one by one you need to put to uh, fast put D all right that's it and exit I hope you learn something <coughs> never ever delete any of this partition only resize the user data partition bear in mind always remember that one should delete any one of them well it's hard to restore it back sometime for the expert you have to flash it in ETL mod and furthermore ETL mod are blocked on Xiaomi you can flash in ETL anymore you can only flash in a fast put only alright that's it thank you for watching stay tuned for the next video